come to you again with another uh, cheap solution to a common problem. Um, we're going to cover the uh, Broadlink RM Pro, um, which is basically the uh, hub portion of what you would buy when you have a Harmony. I have a Harmony hub actually down in the theater. Um, but this is this is kind of a similar thing, but better. And what makes it better is not only does it transmit IR signals, infrared, but it has the ability to learn and retransmit RF signals, which got me to thinking. Um, I've had blinds. Uh, we've got some big windows, the western facing, and uh, the, the sun pours in. So for the last five years or so, I've had these blinds here. And you can spend thousands and thousands of dollars on automated blinds, which uh, I'd prefer to avoid. So I ended up ordering these ones on blinds.com um, and hardwiring them into a 12 volt supply, and they work great. Uh, the disadvantage to these blinds is the remote, which is pretty cheesy, but we've been using them and they're fine. Um, the remote's just a basic RF remote. You have your up, your down, uh, and your pause. And uh, this is the left and right. I've got them split uh, left and right in the centers uh, on separate frequencies. And that was fine, but um, if I forgot to lower them on a hot day uh, and we weren't home, uh, obviously there's nothing I can do about that, so there was no automation ability um, based on weather and that type of thing. It's just... Uh, a dumb but wireless um, set of blinds. So, the solution to this is coupling it with the uh, Broadlink RM Pro, teaching it to learn those codes, and uh, and it actually works. And uh, I'm gonna link, um, I'll, I'll share a link to another video, I think the guy's name's Pete, uh, but he walks you through the setup, so he does a great job with that, I'm not gonna repeat it, I just wanna show you how you can apply um, the the uh, software portion so that it works with uh, Amazon's Echo. Uh, I can't say her name because she'll ask what I want. So, although you know what, I will do it now. We'll give it a shot. So, just to give you an example of how it works, um, let's see. And bear with me because I just set this up. I remember what I call them. Alexa, turn on all blinds. And well, there she goes. You can see it triggered the outer ones just a couple seconds before it triggered the inner, inner blinds. Uh, so the only um, awkward part of it is the telling her to trigger it on and off. Um, I, here's a chihuahua who's getting her last looks in before the windows go down. Uh, obviously I prefer to ask her to lower the blinds and raise the blinds, uh, but that looks like a limitation that I'm not going to be able to get around. Uh, at the moment, at least I'm not smart enough to figure out how to get around that. If I do, I'll update the video. But this thing works awesome. Um, it, it's, it gives you phone access to, not just through uh, Amazon. Um, but I, I'm, I'm really happy with it. Uh, also programmed it to uh, take care of the infrared portion uh, for the TV receiver we have here in the living room. Uh, Alexa, turn off TV. So, thing works great. Um, these can be had for, I paid 35 bucks shipped. Comes with a little uh, quick start user's guide. And um, yeah, for 35 bucks, I, I, I don't know how you could beat that. It's a, it's a crazy value. Um, and it's got a ton of different uh, potential options. But for me, um, controlling these blinds, I, I, I want to say we paid like 1200 bucks for all six of those blinds. You'll spend that on one motorized blind um, that is truly meant to be integrated into a smart home. So uh, for 35 bucks, you can take blinds that cost 25, 20 or 25% of the cost of a true smart home blind and make it just as smart. So great product, really impressed with it. And uh, as I continue to learn what it can do, I'll, uh, I'll post some updated videos. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, as always, put them in the comment section. I watch it pretty closely and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks. Have a great day.